Welcome to this yoga class about anxiety and fears. Fear and anxiety are in all of us. But at the same time, ease and lightness and joy is also in all of us. In this yoga practice, we use out of the many tools yoga provides us to manage anxiety and fears, we use three things. We use asana, to make the energy flow in our body. We use the breath, which is very close related to the mind. When we breathe, we let the energy flow better and we also calm down the mind. And our last tool is will be actually working with our mind. So let's have fun together. We're gonna start in standing. Our first tool is the slow breath. And we're gonna start inhaling with a simple exercise, lifting the arms over the side and up. And exhaling over the middle line, bring your hands down to the heart. Separate your hands and release your hands to the side. And now go with your own breathing rhythm, inhaling to lift your arms up and exhaling to lower your arms down. We were talking about a slow breath, so go as slow as possible for you. You know when you go too slow, you will grasp after the next breath, so find a comfortable slowness. Really here very important not to compare, Really tune in to your breath, inhaling to lift, exhaling to lower. Breath is one of the most important tools to make really changes in your life. Last one. From here we go side bending. Let's side bend first to the right. I won't mirror you, so you go to your right, I go to my right. And then side bending to the left. Feel the hips move and the entire spine is side bending. Beautiful. Let's use the arms. Left arm up first, hips to the side, and then lower down. And when you're all the way down, change the arms. Exhaling to the side. Feel how you really contract on the left side. And inhaling back when you're two thirds down, release the other. This is deepening our breath, opening the intercostal area so we can breathe freer. So keep the quality of your slow breath. And here we open these respiratory muscles to deepen our breath so our breath becomes slow. And One more each side. Beautiful. From here we go into a balancing pose. Inhaling, raise your arms up to shoulder level. Exhaling, slowly lower down. Raise standing two is interlacing the hands in front of you, lifting all the way up. Raise your heels. 
exhaling, arms over the side down, then you're two third down, your heels have arrived. In, raise, standing one, extending, in, raise, standing two, with forward salute, extending. Good. So now feel how you in, raise your heels and arms, and ex, you release your heels and you release your arms. Go in your own breathing rhythm. Last round. Beautiful. Have one hand on your abdomen, one hand on your chest. In, breathe first down into your abdomen. Then let the breath expand up to your chest. And then exhale all the way out. Draw the belly button in at the end. Repeat. And we take that complete breath into the first round of sun salutations. So you may come from a lovely yoga practice. We practice with three yoga flows. So if you practice maybe a little bit different, just get used to it every time you watch it. We make a lot of spinal movements, but have the primary focus for today on your breath. Inhaling upward salute, lift your arms over the side and up. Exhaling earth touch, bend your knees, groins back with the long spine, reach forward and you at your maximum forward bend, relax your spine. In lengthen from the base, Exhale, walk or jump back into mountain. Lean forward, stretch back. Now in this mountain, draw your lower belly in and stretch your sit bones up. Press your heels down. Feel the action in your lower belly, lifting these hips back and high. With your next exhalation, cap tuck round neck, Chest, tuck the tailbone, bend the knees, come down in the round cat. In cat, lengthen from the base. Ex, feel your breath sway back into child. Inhale here. Ex, cat, tuck, round neck, chest, tuck the tailbone, come up. In cat, lengthen from the base. Ex, tuck your toes, sway back, mountain, lift, mountain. Inhale, lengthen your spine, look halfway up. Bend your knees and bounce forward, extend and bend. And relax your spine down into earth touch. Inhale here. Expand your knees, tuck the tailbone and roll up vertebra by vertebra. The arms are very relaxed. When the shoulders are over the hips, lift your arms over the side and up. And exhaling, release your arms over the side and down. Let's repeat. In, upward salute. Make sure you breathe, ex, earth, touch. Inhaling, lengthen your spine, lift halfway up. Expand your knees, walk or jump back, mountain, lift mountain. Inhale, ex, cat, tuck. In, lengthen into cat. Ex, relax back into child. Inhale. 
eggs, cap chakra, neck, chest, tuck the tailbone, come forward. In cat, lengthen from the base. Eggs, tuck both feet, lift your sit bones, sway back. Inhale, lift your spine halfway up, bend your knees, pull back and light jump or walk forward and relax your spine into earth touch. Inhale, expand your knees, roll up vertebra by vertebra, feel your spine until the shoulders are over the hips, then expand your arms in upward salute. X arms over the side and down. Last one, in upward salute. X earth touch. In monkey lengthen from the base, spine halfway up. X mountain bow or jump back. Inhale. X cat tuck. In cat lengthen from the base. X release back into child. Inhale. X cat tuck. In cat, X way back, mountain lift, mountain, inhale, and then lengthen from the base of the spine, look halfway up, bend your knees, sway back with the weight of your body, and light jump forward, earth touch. Inhale, expand your knees, tuck the tailbone, roll up. In upward salute. Ex flowing on release, hands to the heart. Standing. How relaxed and joyful can you be standing still? Have all the awareness of all the body sensations and stay centered and focused for this practice around your breath. Beautiful. Let's add the sound of Uchai. The exhalation, whisper the sound of ah. When you inhale, draw the air into the back of your mouth and visualize it up to the third eye crown. And repeat. Let's add the sound of ucha e to that practice. Remember for this practice that a, a focus on the breath, having the breath slow and deep is our main focus. That's really working that nervous system very well. The asanas also release tension, but the breath is number one. Your next inhalation forward salute. Exhaling, earth touch. And then take your blocks and have them behind you. Sit back. Lengthen from the base of the spine into basic squat. So see here the knees are over your ankles and your shoulders are over the hips and the buttocks is off the mat. From here, slowly lower down. Move both feet forward, just a little bit. And from here, roll back. Have your knees over the foreheads and your 
ankles or the knees and then with the relaxed spine come forward and lift yourself up back into basics into squat and you repeat that a few rounds forwards and backward make sure you breathe either exhaling back inhaling forward or vice versa even flow rolling back rolling forward lengthening the spine Repeat five more rounds. The arms stay really relaxed. Just at the end, when you lift up into a squat, use them. Two more to go. Last one, and from here we move the knees forward and we come back into cat, and from cat we sway back into mountain. Complete Ucha Ibra. Your next exhalation, right side swan, press your left heel back in lengthen. X mountain lift mountain. Inhale. X left side swan with the relaxed spine come forward, left knee to the left hand, lengthen from the base. And sway back into mountain lift, mountain. X right side forward. In lengthen your spine. X sway back, mountain lift, relax, mountain inhale. X left. In lengthen. X ray back, inhale, X right, in lengthen, X ray back. From here, exhale left side swan, in lengthen. And then exhaling swan bow. Feel how the long spine is hinging forward, the toes relax. And then with the round spine come up and lengthen from the base. X bow down. In round and roll. Two more. X swan bow. In swan, X one bow, in swan. Beautiful. Your next exhalation. Transition into the twist. So we are left side swan. Now lean towards your left and bring your right leg over and across. I just turn so you can see me. Have that right leg up and have your left heel on the side so you're not sitting on that left heel. In case you want to prop yourself, you know I love propping, propping for twists. In case you want to prop yourself, just sit yourself a little bit higher up. That first twist is with the knee looking up to the ceiling. In case this bottom leg is not going well here, bend it 
you can lean back and bring that bottom leg forward. And from the sitting position you have chosen, let's twist towards our right. Belly button first, then ribs, shoulders and arms, hug your knee, and then look over your right shoulder back. Feel both sit bones grounding down. Lengthen your spine up. Let your breath flow. Inhaling completely with the sound of Ujjayi. At the end of the inhalation, have a little relax. Feel some form of ease. And exhaling, exhale all the way up. At the end of the exhalation, draw the belly button in, feel a little break, relax, get a sense of ease. And repeat, in complete, relax, exhale out completely, relax. Repeat in your own breathing rhythm. And relax in these little breaks between in and exhalation. After your next exhalation, unbind belly button, ribs, shoulders, neck, and head, and bring your knee forward so that. Your knee is stuck on top of your knees are stuck on top of each other. Serenity seat. Make sure you sit on both sit bones evenly and have your shoulders leveled. Have both waistlines even long. And from here, twist again to your right. Twisting lower, middle, upper back. Keep both waistlines even long. Relax your facial muscles, look over your right shoulder. Twisting with different leg position is helping you to release some tension around the hips, pelvic floor, and lower abdomen. Important for our management of anxiety and fear. Here, slowly unbind, lower, middle, upper back, and we come into a forward bend. In serenity seat, hinge forward from the base of the spine. You may can just lean a little bit forward, you may can lean hips. I just demonstrate halfway bending forward, keeping the head up, broaden chest. Use here a different breathing technique to lengthen and strengthen our respiratory muscles. Inhale in three parts. Inhale to the belly. Second part of the inhalation to the heart. Third part of the inhalation to the third eye. Exhale all the way out in one flow. In belly. In heart, in third eye, X in one flow. Repeat. Keep repeating, surrender in your forward bends. Allow the breath to expand in your body. Surrender a little bit more, last breath.
beautiful. Inhale here. Gently relax your spine, come up. Lengthen from the base and we go back into left side swan. So stretch your right leg to the side and back. Keep it straight. And then sway back into mountain, lift mountain. Feel the opposite sensation around your right hip and left hip. And invite the breath deep down. Remember the slow breath and the deep breath. Deep meaning down, deep down into your lower lungs, into the abdomen. With your next exhalation, right side swan. Push your left heel back, round your spine, bring your right knee forward. In lengthen. X one bow, release your toes. In swan, come up. X one bow. In swan. Three more. Go with your breath. You can always have a breath in between. Going slower. Or you go exhaling down and inhale. Last round. And from here, lean towards your right, onto your right hip. Feel the left leg, keep it straight, bringing it all the way over and across. First twist is with the knee straight up to the ceiling. Sit on a little pillow if that helps you to keep with this hip opening, both sit bones grounded both waistlines even long and your sternum above the belly button. From here we twist to the left. Belly button, ribs, shoulders, neck and head. Keep your knee to your torso and keep lengthening your spine. Inhale here. Complete Ujjayi breath. When you have fully inhaled, feel that little break and feel you relax here, find ease. And exhaling, release the breath all the way out. Relax. In complete Ujjayi breath. Relax at the top. X all the way out. Find a moment of relaxation and ease. Repeat. Your next exhalation unbind. Lower, middle, upper back. Bring your knee now forward. Remember, you also have the option with this bottom leg straight. So in serenity, it would like look like this. So here, really important to have a different hip opening. Remember, we want to re relax here in our lower abdomen and pelvic floor. And we go into the twist again. Lower, middle, upper back. Relax where you feel the tension in your twist. Let your
your breath flow. Your next exhalation unwind, lower, middle, upper back, and then hinge forward into the forward bend, serenity forward bend. From here, at the three part inhalation, into the belly, into the heart, into third eye and exhaling complete out. If you like to add the mantra OM, do so. OM, first OM to the belly button, second OM to the heart, third OM to the third eye, exhaling all the way out. After your next exhalation, slowly come back up. And from here, we lean back and we bring both legs forward. And we come back into a reclined position. Slowly roll yourself down. knees to chest. So far we have worked with the breath and this is the first tool you can use if you recognize fearful thoughts in your mind. You switch from the thought to a breathing, breathing technique. Exhaling, lower your feet down. Inhaling, roll up, bridge pose. Exhaling, roll down. Push each vertebra into the floor. Repeat. In tucking the tailbone, push vertebra by vertebra into the floor while one vertebra after each other is lifting and exhaling lower down. Last round. And then Next time when you roll up into bridge pose, stay bridge asana, you wanna use your blocks underneath. You can take them as a little pile, two pile this high, two pile a little bit higher, or one block using you one block flat or one block up. So have your feet hip width apart, have your Ankles underneath your knees, tuck the tailbone under and roll up. And you find your height. Complete breath at Uchai. And we go to our second mental tool where Patanjali says, if you have a 
thoughts, let's say a negative thought, replace it with the opposite thought. So let's say we are fearful. So we can replace it with I am loved and cared for. I am loved and cared for. And what you do is you internally repeat, I am loved and cared for. Or I am in peace and trust. Keep repeating, if other thoughts come, let them pass through. The ego sometimes rebels, it wants to stay with our negative habitual thoughts. If you hear that voice of the ego, let it pass through, concentrate on your new mantra, I am loved and cared for, I am in peace and trust. with that ego, it wants to interfere again and again. And with all your self-love and patience, you go back to your new mantra and you keep repeating it. Three more breaths here in the pose. And with your next inhalation, lift your hips up. Then remove your blocks. And then vertebra by vertebra roll out. Partially climb. Have a breath here. X lift your heels, bring your knees in, knees to chest. Let a deep sigh go through the body. Feel your entire back. And then take your hands onto your knees and draw little circles. Give permission to the lower abdomen to relax. Relax all the way down into your pelvic floor. Change direction. to center, lower your feet down and make yourself comfortable for final relaxation. You can have your blocks underneath your knees, you can have a pillow underneath your head. You can cover yourself if you easily get cold. Then allow yourself to drop into your mat. With each exhalation, relax a little bit deeper. Inhaling, feel your feet and your legs. 
exhaling, relax your feet and your legs. Feel your feet and your legs heavy and relaxed. In, feel your hips and pelvic girdle. Really be there. Ex, relax your hips and pelvic girdle. In, breathe down into your abdomen. Feel this abdomen expanding. And ex, relax your abdomen. In, breathe down into the abdomen and then up into your chest. And ex, relax in your chest, relax around your heart. Soften the armor you may carry around your heart. In, feel your shoulders, arms and hands. Ex, relax your shoulders, arms and hands. In, feel your neck. Ex, relax your neck. In, feel your head. Ex, relax in your head. Relax your jaws. Feel the gentle touch of your lips. Relax the roof of the mouth, the sides of the mouth and the bottom of the mouth. Relax your cheeks and your temples. Relax from the outer ears into the inner ears. Relax around your eyes. Let the eyeballs drop back into their sockets. Inner eye gaze remains to the third eye. Relax the spot between the eyebrows, your forehead and the brain behind. With the body relaxed and the breath rhythmical, become aware of the witness state of your mind, simply allowing the thoughts to pass through. Letting go into the inner flow. I am fearless and free. I am fearless and free. Trayam bakam yajama hai Sukam dil pushi bharanam Urvaru kamiva pandanam Ritiyo mukshiya amrita Oh, try.
Slowly intensify your breath, just breathing. Then start moving your body, stretch out, yawn, be grateful for who you are and all the talents you are given. Knees to chest. Rolling to the side and sit yourself up. Namaste, sweet fans. I hope you liked that video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and see you soon to more videos here.